Welcome to the www.sakalavija.com viewers. So far we have discussed 3 or 4 episodes on engineering entrance examination problems that means tips and tricks or even we say that shortcuts. So in this episode also we are going to discuss some more additional shortcuts or tips and tricks regarding to the various engineering entrance examinations and moreover after completion of this session, this episodes, we are going to upload Polytechnic means Diploma Engineering Mathematics and B.Tech B.E. Engineering Mathematics are going to, uh, going to be uploaded. So, in our YouTube channel as well as in our site www.sakalavija.com. So, moreover one thing I would like to share with you. So, beside this every day we are going to post one shortcut or one tip on FB, so Facebook page also our page. So, better so you can find our link below our description. So, please subscribe our channel, our website as well as Facebook for the further uploads. I think I hope you might have followed. So, share you with your friends also. Once again I repeat, so please share any queries any doubts regarding to the problems even some shortcut methods you have that can be posted in, in queries in comments box. So, thank you. Now, once again we shall move to the next episode. First problem, if d is equal to data of 4 factorial, 5 factorial, 6 factorial, 5 factorial, 6 factorial, 7 factorial, 6 factorial, 7 factorial and 8 factorial. Then d divided by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 is divisible by is divisible by First option 37, second option 31, third option 29, fourth option 23. So, now, so let us analyze this problem. See the D stands for determinant of the this 3 by 3 square matrix. You know 4 factorial means 24, 5 factorial means 120, 6 factorial means 720, very bigger values you may get it. So, by writing all those values and getting determinant is very lengthy method. But what we have to find out D by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 is divisible by. So, we are not asked to find out here determinant value. So, here we are asked to find out d by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 divisible by. So, so that means whether it is divisible by 37, 31, 29, 23 that we have to find out. So, in our actually regular classes or traditional methods we have one problem that problem can be taken as a shortcut here. So, let us take that problem by substituting so, we get the answer. Okay, shall we do it now? So, now just you remember this hint, this will be very very useful I think so. So, if you have any more shortcut rather than this one also you can follow that is depends upon you. Okay, now, if d is equal to determinant of you say this is n factorial, you can write this is n plus 1 factorial 
this you can write n plus 2 factorial. Again this is 5 factorial means you can write n plus 1 factorial, this is n plus 2 factorial, this is n plus 3 factorial. That means n stands for 4 factorial here, n factorial stands for. So, next here n plus 2 factorial, n plus 3 factorial, here n plus 4 factorial, you can check it. If substitute n is equal to 4 here, 4 plus 4, 8 factorial. So, now then this d divided by n factorial whole cube minus 4 is equal to. So, this value we have to find out. That value is given by here 2 n into n square plus 4 n plus 5. So, this value 2 n into n square plus 4 n plus 5. So, now let us come to the problem what we have to find out d by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 after that. So, divisible by 37, 31, 29, 23 we have to verify. So, that means first let us find out now here put n is equal to 4. Now, d by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 is equal to 2 into 4 n stands for 4 into n square n square is 16 plus 16 plus 5. So, this is 8 multiplied by 37. Now, the factors of this one is 8 and 37, it is divisible by 8, it is divisible by 37. See 37 is there. So, that means now d by 4 factorial whole cube minus 4 has one of the factors 37 as well as 8. So, that means it is divisible by 8, it is also divisible by 2, it is also divisible by 4, it is also divisible by 37. See if you check of the 4 options 37 will be the right option am I correct. So, first one is the right option.